first we're going to do is what we call the ride. And we're going we're gonna to use these with, uh, with angle once, okay? Just because it's the easiest to see and it's, it also makes everything else, like we talked about, the shorter, more simpler angles, even more simple. So he's going to send the angle one, okay? And we're going to ride right in. Notice how I go right to the target. And a lot of people, when they ride, they do this. It's not riding. That's just being on top. I want to ride this hand in. Also notice, where's my body? Off to the side. Off to the side. That's right. Okay. So we're going to ride in and thrust, come back, grab, and do it this Okay. Same idea now. He sends the other angle one. We're going to ride, thrust, and disarm. Ride, thrust, and disarm. Ride, thrust, and disarm. So he takes one, two, three steps. One, two, three steps. Right? That's going to help him loosen up. And that's definitely going to help him loosen up. Okay? So again, the disarm is gravy to the stab. The stabs are what makes this happen. The stab is the meat. Does anybody not understand this? No? Okay. So, we just ride. Notice I ride with the forearm when I do this? Here. Okay. Sometimes you'll see this done. If you have high protection, I'll do this. You'll see this done this way. See, it goes to the throat first, then to the body, then to the body, then to the body. And okay. so we're learning to educate both the hands on how to move. Any questions? No? All right. Oh, we got two more. Two. Notice how I get over to the side though. I don't want to stand in front of him for this. Okay? No standing in front. Get those feet moving. Right. 